Well, welcome back to this VR News Show right here on C Today. So um, we're still in our signature segment, See the Stories. Let's continue with our talk with solo traveling content creator. We have Dimas Ramadan with us here today. Hi. Hi again. Hi again. <laughs> so I mean, yeah. you have traveled so much on your own and you have actually shared some really, really interesting stories, how you found a lot of yourself in your solo traveling. Can you name us how many countries have you been to? Like you said 67 countries, but what were like the best countries you've traveled to and what are the most Risk. Interesting, interesting and riskiest uh, experiences that you've traveled to. Okay, I guess... As a solo traveler. Yeah, I guess, as a solo traveler. I guess for me, the most beautiful country that I've been to is uh, Kyrgyzstan. Kyrgyzstan. Yeah, it's so beautiful. Like, And even as an Indonesian, it's uh, we just have to apply uh, e-visa to go there. Mm. So yeah, it's not really complicated. And when I, I was there, it's so amazing, like the nature and also the people is amazing. Yeah, and uh, for me, like the most craziest things when I travel uh, as a solo traveler is uh, when I was going to uh, Kosovo. Mm. It's interesting because, you know, that time I was uh, come from Serbia by bus uh, yeah. to Kosovo and it's kind of experience because they have some, I don't know, war things. I don't it's a know. conflict. It's conflict. a conflict region, yeah. Yeah. And then when I, I, I was there, like, okay, it's kind of scary, but uh, okay, then uh, it's okay for me because I'm a tourist and they know. And yeah, so just respect some cultural things. So my question, uh, Serbia, Kosovo is actually a conflict zone, right? What was it like to be traveling in a conflict zone? Did people or did you did you have to research first uh, where you could go to safety? For example, I know that there is an Indonesian embassy in Serbia and, and Kosovo as well. But how did you feel traveling in a conflict zone? Because there was you're like meters away from war. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh well, actually. It, or conflict. So because before I planned to that country, mm -hmm. usually I do research, right? So then. It told me that oh it's okay it's fine but just respect the uh, the local culture and everything and stuff and then when I travel there like I try to take a picture and but suddenly a people like some random people come to me hey you cannot take a picture of that and then oh sorry 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 and yeah from that moment that I realized that oh I cannot uh, do anything I want here I need to be more respectful and that those kind of things. Were it, there any specific rules to adhere when you're in a conflict zone? Um, actually, just try to be more... Um, low-key. Yeah, low-key. Okay. Speak politely. Speak politely. <laughs> okay. And don't make any mistake like... Mm. Yeah, you know. There are some things that pro prohibited that mm -hmm. uh, it's not prohibited in other countries. Yeah. Um, okay, you also travel to a lot of places in Indonesia, right? Many mm -hmm. destinations that perhaps even Indonesians don't know. So tell us the most memorable places that you visit visit in our country. Oh, I guess it's Antete. Mm -hmm. I really love it. Like it's the most beautiful province in Indonesia. And even after I travel to 67 countries, I still feel that Indonesia is the best one. Really? From the food, from the nature, everything. I love my country. Like even I already traveled there, I don't want to live in those country or those city. I still choose Indonesia. Okay. Hang on. So you mentioned the food. Food. Mm -hmm. So Which? what was the craziest food that you thought was wow? You didn't expect this to be yummy, but it looked very Dodgy. adventurous. Uh, adventurous? Uh, I was like, or like because I know that immersing yourself with food is something completely different, right? Mm -hmm. yeah. When you travel, do you still look for rice, or do you actually, actually try I, to mm. tr uh, try to try the local cuisine? Really. Actually, for me, like, I don't know, maybe my tongue is Indonesian tongue, so every time I go, I always find rice. But also, it's okay for me to try the local cuisine. Mm. And then I try that, mm, I guess this is not my taste, but at least it's a must. If I go to some country or some places, I try it. Mm -hmm. So it's kind Has of... Has there been a place where it was very difficult to find rice? Yeah, of course, there's a lot. 
which which continent, for example, or which country? Mm. I know Indonesian travelers are taking notes. Yeah. Right now. I would say maybe mm, Balkans country. Balkans. Yeah, that's oh, true. Okay. But I love the Balkans. Yeah. Have okay. you been there? I, I, I have been to um, you know Romania, Serbia, oh, and all cool. that. The, the the Dracula region. Oh, nice. <laughs> okay, so as an Indonesian, Dimas. Uh, you met many foreigners, definitely, because you travel a lot and you have also met people from many, many different corners of the world as well. So how do you contribute in promoting respect for cultures, ethical uh, travel in your videos? Do you okay. also insert those uh, values as well? Yeah, so when I travel, sometimes I also put some uh, lesson like, hey, when you come here, please uh, put your trash uh, on it. Uh, on the trash. I mean, don't put trash everywhere. You know what, what I mean? Like, mm -hmm. and then uh, try to bring your bot your own bottle because, of course, don't use uh, single-use plastic. And then bring your own bag when you go to this uh, Super grocery market. supermarket. Yeah. So sustainability mm -hmm. is number one. So I always teach them in my Instagram stories. Oh, yeah. that's great. That's a, a twenty uh, a twenty twenty three version. Okay, so um, it won't be complete if we don't ask our guests to play a game. So it's not see the stories anyway if you don't play a little game with the guests. So Dimas will play against Kai since both of you are also gloat trotters, <laughs> right? So to guess what the country is that is going to featured on the plasma. So we have the big screen behind you, Dimas. And the screen will actually show you a combination of emojis and pictures. And you need okay. to guess. First, the we will have. Which one do you want to use? Mm, this one. Okay. Okay. So you got your. All right. <laughs> clown bell. <laughs> clown bell and a ring bell. Okay. All right. Remember to ring the bell before you answer, okay? I'm okay. I'm gonna nerve because it's, you know, never been. Uh, in a this game before. It's okay. Uh, yeah. It's always adventurous anyway. Your solo travel is always okay. Here it is. Uh, high tea. That's right. High is tea. It high tea. High tea. High tea. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's cool. High tea. Oh, okay. One for Kai. I was like matcha. Okay, now next. What is this? <laughs> oh. Yeah. Oh man. Oh man. Oh, man. oh yeah. <laughs> Okay, think out of the box, all think right? Think out of the box. Just, just look at the emoji. Don't yeah, think look much. at the emoji. Don't think too much. That's right. Okay. Next. Tang, uh, Tonga. Tonga. Absolutely Tonga. correct. Tonga. Oh my God, I love Tonga. Yeah, I uh, really want it. That's my, one of my uh, bucket, bucket list. Yeah, yes, the nature. Pacific Island. Oh, yeah. All right, let's go next. Chi yeah. Is it the chili? Uh, no, it's strawberry. Strawberry sing. Jamaica. Jamaica. Yep. Oh yeah, Jamaica. Jump, Mike. Uh, ah, oh yeah. Oh, Kai's uh, really good at this. Okay. <laughs> All right. Well, well I we love this. This is the first emoji game Sing, I'm actually uh, facing. Mm, oh, really? Okay. Mic up for Mika. Oh, this. Don't think it as a mic. What do you use sing, your mic for? Sing. Yeah. Sing. Sing. Uh, sing. Uh, four. Singapore. Yeah. Singapore. Singapore. But you have to yeah. ring the bell. Don't forget. <laughs> Yeah, Singapore. Singapore. Yeah. Singapore. Okay, so yeah, one yeah. for Dimas and I guess four for you, right? Oh, it's so uh, difficult, yeah. you know. Actually. Okay, you can still ace this. Let's see the next one. Pill. Pill. It's Philippine. Philippines. Philippines. The Philippines. Yeah. Yep. Don't forget to ring the bell. Oh yeah. You forgot the bell. He's yeah, just too yeah. excited. And for he, this. He's got the bell in his hands, you know. Yeah. <laughs> okay, ring it. Next. Um. Egg, egg, egg. Egg is on a. Egg. Look at the pictures. <laughs> yep. Egg. Panama. That's right. It's on a pan. Oh, I, I pan thought it's an egg. Ah, like, ma. Ah. Oh, and a so mom. Egg, mom. Egg, mom. Egg, mom. I'm so Panama. bad at this game. <laughs> it's okay. You need to practice. It, this is this is a game that you need to practice. You need like, to practice. I, I would usually be really bad at this, but for some reasons I'm okay yeah. at country. I'm really bad at this emoji. Yeah, yeah. Me too. Me too. It's not just you. It's Music fun works. anyway. Okay, well, here's the last one, number eight. Let's see. Australia. Oh, Australia. Austria. 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 That was close, actually. Austria. Oh yeah. Yes. 
So did we consider that? I'm Anna embarrassed. <laughs> You were in Austria before. I am she embarrassed. Oh, you were there? Yeah. Yes, I lived there oh. for a couple of years. Never mind. But uh, uh, it's just a game to f have fun with. I wish I would play against Hans. Oh, Hans. <sighs> He's the master of games. Oh. But anyway, we, we have very competitive right? hosts here. So yeah. I'm very happy you enjoyed the game because yeah. when you come back, there's going to be more. Yeah. <laughs> when you come back, there's going to be a lot of other okay. different types of games. So anyway, thank you so much. We did yeah. have thank fun so as well. Thank you so much for having me here. Thank yeah. you for your stories. Yeah. And um, I do cool. hope that your book will come to place. And once you finish that book, please do come and share uh, what it is all about here yeah. and, uh, with, with us all. Consult Sorry. with your mom. She's the writer. Yeah. Right? True. <laughs> <laughs> all right. So don't go anywhere yet because we will still have other stories in our See the Story segment. And that's going to be next after the break. Stay tuned.